Hey, so today I'm going to talk about a few browser extensions that you should use if you're concerned about protecting your privacy on the internet. Um, there's a lot of cases recently, you know, Edward Snowden was kind of the biggest one with um, the information that's tracked about people when they use the internet. And so I'm just going to go into detail about a few extensions that will help you when you're on, on the web and it'll help keep you safe. So the first one's called Ghostery. It uh, detects tracking on the websites you visit and then uh, actually blocks the trackers and it improves your browsing experience because if the website doesn't have to load those scripts that are tracking you, then it actually speeds up the page load time. So it eliminates clutter on those websites and uh, it uses artificial intelligence to um, you know kind of learn those trackings and then just continue to improve itself. So it's a pretty cool extension. Uh, I think you should use it if you're using the web at all. So um, Another one that's similar to that one is called Privacy Badger. Uh, it's kind of similar to Ghostery in that it blocks tracking, but a cool feature about this one is that it only blocks the tracking scripts that follow you, say, from one website to another website. So if you click a link on a website, that first website isn't able to you know, follow you to that next one and see you know, what you browse after you leave the website. So Privacy Badger, that's another one. Um, the third one is called Disconnect. Um, they kind of have a few products. Um, they have multiple browser extensions. <clears throat> the one I'm focusing on is Disconnect Private Browsing. It works by blocking third-party trackers on websites you visit. So whenever the website makes a network request to connect to anything besides that site, it won't be able to load that extra stuff. So that could be ads or you know, trackers or whatever it is. Uh, the next one is called NoScript Security Suite. It, this one's for Mozilla Firefox that blocks malicious scripts that could be used for tracking. So it's kind of similar to Disconnect, but it's more for Mozilla Firefox. So if you use that one, if you use Firefox, NoScript's a good one. And Edward Snowden actually endorses this one as a tool to fight surveillance states. So that's pretty cool too. Uh, ScriptSafe's another one. <clears throat> it's like NoScript. But it works for Google Chrome and other browsers. Um, it has really solid reviews online, and it allows users to easily switch it on and off. So if you know you're on a website and something's not loading right, then you can turn off Script Safe temporarily, load that up, and then turn it back on when you're uh, ready to move on. Uh, next is Search Encrypt. Um, it's a search tool. So rather than using you know a search engine that you'd have to go away from a site to search. Uh, you can actually use pretty much any search engine you want and uh, Search Encrypt will detect if it's tracking you or not <clears throat> and then it'll redirect that search. So it encrypts that search term and then redirects it to its private search engine and then returns its private search results. So that one's pretty cool. If you haven't heard of Search, search Encrypt, you might want to look it up and considering giving it an install. And yeah, those are uh, some browser extensions that'll help protect you when you're browsing the web. So good luck.